Hi guys, this is James from ES Sabres. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to charge your Sabre. Um, most of the um, people that have bought Sabres so far found it okay, but there are a couple where the, um, the hilts have to maybe be taken apart to access the battery, which can be a little bit trickier. So hopefully today's video will show you um, and clarify how, how to charge them. So the majority of our Sabres will have a round port like this. You'll have a cable like so, okay, with your uh, with your sabre. All you're going to do is put one end into the charging port and then the opposite end is a USB uh, connection. So with this, you're gonna put it in any charging head that has a maximum voltage of five volts. So five volts, one amp is what you're looking for. Um, this is the majority of um, charging heads uh, used for small, small devices uh, such as phones but please do check, so I know some of the new iPhones or um, some of like more powerful devices require a slightly, uh, slightly higher voltage uh, charger. So make sure you're not using a 10 volt or a 15 volt because these can damage the boards inside. So you're gonna put that into your charging head, make sure it's five volts, one amp, and then the opposite end which is round port will go into your saber there. So this is the, um, the charging port on the majority of our sabers. They are next to the button. You may have a sabre where you're required to take off the pommel. So sabres such as our Praxium, our Luke, uh, or the Obi, they will all have pommels like this which can come off. And you will have a small charging port just here. Okay. So with this one, okay, slightly different, it's not a round port, it's a USB-C head, okay, like this one. So push it in like so okay and again the other side is USB so you're just going to put this into a 5 volt 1 amp charging head okay and you'll see a little light pop on here to show it will indicate that it's charging um, you may have one of our other premium sabers where oh, sorry, you may have one of our other premium sabers where you're required to take out the battery. So it won't have a round port charging cable and it won't have a USB-C charging cable. So one like this, for example. Uh, with the majority of these, you're going to unscrew the hilt, which should be from the center. Okay, they may have a battery cover on, like so. You're just going to unscrew this. Okay, and that will allow you to access the battery. So you can take the battery out. If you're struggling, take it out with your fingers, which because they can be quite tight. Just get your Allen key that comes with the Sabre and just gently prise it out like so to help you get the battery out. So when you've charged the battery, okay, making sure that you put the battery in the right way. So the negative end and the positive end, okay, match it up on the external charger, negative and positive. You're going to push this in. Okay, you'll see a red light appear, which means it's charging. When it goes green, then it means it's fully charged. So you can plug the opposite end, which is USB, into any USB charging head that's five volts, one amp max. Okay, um, and when the battery's charged, you're just gonna reinsert it back into your saver and then put the help back together by screwing it together. Um, I hope you found this useful, okay. Um, if you need any help taking your saver apart to access the battery, please do write in the comments or drop us an email at sales at es-sabers.co.uk and I'll be happy to help. Thank you and see you soon.